morning guys welcome back to the vlog and welcome back to part two of this Greece mini series so today we are on our way so we're just at the supermarket now we've grabbed some breakfast we've grabbed some snacks for the day and we are driving into Hanya to pick up a boat for the day which is so exciting we did this a couple of weeks ago when we were in a different part of Greece and it's so much better having a boat for yourself rather than have someone drive it for you just because it means you literally have total freedom you can go wherever you want and you can stop off you can swim you can snorkel like we saw some amazing places a few weeks ago um if you haven't already seen it on my instagram make sure you go and follow me because i will spam today on there and yeah we're just gonna go drive around the boat the one that we're getting you don't need to have a boat license for so we obviously can pick it up without having to know how to ride a boat they like give you a few instructions before you pick it up um and yeah we'll just see where the day takes us <laughs> Step into the world outside The future never looks so bright Can't you hear it calling us? If you are coming to Crete and you're staying in this part of Crete I would highly, highly recommend Sea and Sun Boat Rental They were amazing from start to finish We hired the Poseidon 510 Which is actually the biggest boat that you can hire Without needing a boat licence But it costs €180 Euros for a full day rental which obviously if you go for a slightly smaller engine size it may be a little bit cheaper and then depending on how much distance you cover there may be a fuel charge on top of that so just bear that in mind if you are hiring one let go leave all of your cares behind you never know where you might find sunny days are coming up dreaming of tomorrow soaking up We sent an email and I, I asked if there was parking nearby because from driving into Hanya the other night, we parked in a pay and display sort of car park, which would have been really expensive for the full day. So I asked them if there was parking and they sent me the location of a free car park, which if you put into Google Maps free parking in Hanya, it literally comes up. It's the one that's right near the harbour. Let's go. Dive into the deep blue sky. Come with me to paradise. Can't you hear it calling us? Can't you hear it calling us? Calling us. Dreaming of tomorrow, soaking up the sun. We can go and find the magic. Yeah, we could run. thing about this company is they actually tell you to download an app once you're on board the boat it's called boat angel they will then create a specific qr code for you to scan in this will show your location it will show all of the points that you can go to where you can drive the boat up and down red zones and amber zones which potentially could change throughout the day depending on the tide and the, the weather conditions it also has loads of different points of interest so there was a specific place that there was caves for example you couldn't stop there and drop your anchor but it was a really good place to go and have a photo spot so it's a really handy tool and it keeps you nice and safe so you don't go into places that you shouldn't be going and if you do accidentally venture into a red zone which may or may not have happened it, the boat actually beeps at you so it really really loudly beeps telling you that you're in a zone that you're not supposed to be in so you can quickly get out of it and go back into safe waters
One thing that wasn't mentioned on the app, though, pulling into a nice little spot where it told us that we could stop, anchor up and swim. Lady swims past, full on in the nude, like, morning, looked up, every single person on the beach was naked. So we quickly turned the boat around. It was really, really awkward. Um, Didn't quite know where to look when that's in your distance. We have just come out to a spot that is literally land's end so we just drove up some dirt track and all that's around is two villas and this crazy crazy view <laughs> like i don't know how much you're going to be able to see with me filming it this way so i'm going to turn the camera around and get some footage of just this insane view Sunset burning on the golden shore Never seen a view like this before The stars, they shine like diamonds in your eyes Black dress on you, got me hypnotized I keep feeling away, I keep feeling away, I keep feeling away about you No, I can't look away, no, I can't look away, no, I can't look away Cause I need you my heart keeps beating like an island drum Cause you're my only one You make me feel so good that vlog here we still have four days left and tomorrow is hopefully going to be the big one so we've got a two hour drive to get to I mean it's the most instagrammable place on earth by the looks of things so I'm very excited providing that I drive there okay so remember to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and remember to subscribe for more and I'll see you in the next one bye